Hi everyone, welcome back to the channel. How are you guys doing? Today I'm going to show you how to make the best ever coconut fried rice. This recipe is not complicated, it is super easy and the result is going to be this beautiful, beautiful coconut fried rice that you're definitely going to love and you can enjoy with your family and friends this season. Before we dive right into the video, in case you're not subscribed to the channel, please click on the subscribe button. Also click on the notification bell to get notified whenever I post videos. And now let's dive right into the recipe. I cannot switch you guys. These are the ingredients we're going to be using. We're using some chopped onions. We're also going to use some carrot. The full ingredient list and their quantities are going to be in the description box. So please check it out. We're also using some greens. We're also using bell peppers. We're using some shrimp. I love shrimp. We're also going to use a bit of spring onions. I'll be using chicken breast for this recipe but you can also use chicken thigh and to that I'm just going to season with a bit of chicken seasoning, some garlic powder, you can also use onion powder, I'm also using a bit of curry powder, a bit of salt and I'm also adding a bit of black pepper. You can also use scotch bonnet peppers if you have that. I'm just going to mix that and combine thoroughly then I'm going to set this aside. You can decide to marinate or you can also not decide to marinate, whatever you want to do is fine. Now to my shrimp, I'm just going to season it with some black pepper and some paprika powder and a bit of salt you do not want to do too much you don't want to over season this just do the basics and you're going to go i'm also just going to mix that thoroughly and combine and then set this aside also you want to make sure that you're draining out like any excess liquid from your shrimp so that it doesn't look funny or it doesn't taste funny now into my pot i'm going to add my coconut oil it is very important that you use coconut oil for this recipe i mean this is coconut fried rice so do not use vegetable oil get yourself coconut oil you just need to make sure that all the flavor in this particular dish is just coconutty somewhere somehow there needs to be coconut now i'm just going to add my shrimp and then i'm just going to cook this for about three minutes shrimp takes really really like fast time or cooks really really fast so you do not want to cook it for long so it does not become rubbery or anything like that so i'm just going to cook that for about three minutes and then i am now going to remove it from the heat i'm also now going to cook my chicken this chicken has marinated for a bit but like i said earlier that's if i said it you do not have to marinate this for like so much time and also if you don't have time no need you can just seasoned and then fry immediately but i'm just going to fry this or cook this until it is done this should take anywhere between five to ten minutes depending on the amount of heat that you have going on as usual with all my fried rice recipe i'm using golden cellar basmati rice you guys ask me all the time i only use tropical sun golden cellar basmati rice and i'm just going to wash that and then put it in my pot i'm cooking my rice with some coconut milk and also some coconut cream actually and some water one part coconut milk one part water and you're good to go i'm also just going to add a bit of salt because you need to salt your rice and then i'm just going to cook this until done as you can see this rice is looking one one i'm going to fluff it off so you guys can see what it looks like please when you're cooking your rice don't overcook it don't add too much water so you can see how the rice is looking one one that is how rice is supposed to be especially when you're making fried rice i'm just going to let that set aside or cool while i set that aside now i'm going to add some coconut oil again in my work and then to that i'm going to add some chopped onions i'm also going to add some garlic um some chopped garlic and then i'm just going to stir this and combine thoroughly you want to make sure you're cooking on medium heat because coconut um, oil gets hot really really fast and you don't want to make like you don't want to make it burn or anything like that i'm going to add some curry powder this is optional but i just like it i'll let that eat up and then i'm going to add some carrots the reason i'm adding my carrots now is because i just want it to be a little bit softer before i add other vegetables if you don't want that you don't have to do it now i'm going to add some thyme i'm also going to add some oregano the fresh if you have fresh ingredients please use them they're always always better but i did not have access to fresh ingredients as i then i'm also going to add my green peas and then i'm just going to mix it and combine thoroughly let me also state that you can use other vegetable of choice you don't have to use the exact vegetables that i have used here you can just switch things up however you want i'm going to season with a bit of salt and some chicken seasoning now i'm going to add my bell peppers as usual you can use whatever color shade size whatever kind of bell peppers you want to use it's fine i'm just going to mix this and combine it already you guys i love 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 the pop of color in this food right now it's giving me all the excitement i need now i'm going to add my already cooked rice again can you see how my rice is it's not 
glued together or gummy it's not looking mushy that's exactly what you want while we're here you guys in case it's the first time you're hearing my voice or in case it's the first time you're seeing a video from me hi everyone my name is daniel i'm a digital content creator and youtuber based in lagos nigeria i share recipe videos like this i also share a bit of my lifestyle in vlogs i share premium content and the fact that you've clicked on this video means you like premium content so you can click on the subscribe button you can also click on the post notification bell to get notified whenever i post videos i post recipe videos twice every week and they're always good recipe videos you can ask in the comment section and people will let you know so please do not forget to click like button do not forget to click the subscribe button now back to our food as you can see i've been stirring this continuously i'm now cooking on high heat because i want to make sure that my rice is not gummy i want to make sure that my rice is not mushy in any way so i'm cooking on high heat so that a little bit of the moisture can evaporate and then it looks like one one now i'm just going to add the chicken and the shrimp that we made earlier and then i'm going to also add some spring onions i did not have a lot of spring onions on this particular day so i just used what i had but you can definitely add more now i'm just going to stir that and combine thoroughly and our coconut fried rice is ready you guys this recipe is a banger you guys when you try it please let me know send me a dm on instagram letting me know how it's worth because i am very sure that it's going to go well you can also follow me on tiktok follow me on instagram follow me on twitter daniela chico underscore on every social media platforms see you guys in my next video maybe it's next year maybe it's not but i love you guys to the moon and back and thank you so much for riding with me on this journey bye